Hi everybody, Mike here from ZoomSafer. Thanks again for being a part of our Android beta. Per the note that you got, we're going to use our Bluetooth trigger to automatically start and stop ZoomSafer while you're driving. With this video, what we wanted to do is show you how to pick an active pairing to trigger ZoomSafer from and then give you a brief demonstration of how ZoomSafer will work in action while you're driving. All right. First, let's see here, we've got my Motorola Droid on the Verizon Wireless Network and you can see a couple things on the screen. I've downloaded ZoomSafer and it's here, right? I've also, right after installation, got a message up here in the message bar and that tells me that I need to pick a Bluetooth uh, pairing for use with ZoomSafer. So let me press on that message. This is the screen that comes up when you just press the ZoomSafer icon once just like that. You get either start Zoom Safer manually or go into basic options. With basic options you can customize your auto replies and at the bottom you can select the active pairing that you want to use to trigger Zoom Safer. I'm going to select this Motorola T505. There it is. I'm going to press save. Okay, we're all set now. Press OK. Now I'm going about my business and I'm going to start to drive now. Okay. So I get in the car, I've got my T505 here, I turn it on, which I do while I'm driving. It connects with the phone, and ZoomSafer immediately activates automatically. Now I'm driving with my T505, I've got my ZoomSafer screen here, I can dial 911 of course and do a couple of other things. Now I reach my destination, I'm going to turn my T505 off because I'm done driving. That turns off, it disconnects from the phone, and I'm back in a normal use. I can click the home key, go right back to my home screen, and use my phone as normal. So that's it. You'll get a message uh, after you download ZoomSafer telling you to pick an active Bluetooth pairing to trigger from. You can go right into basic options, pick your pairing, save that, and you're ready to go. Thanks again for joining the Android beta, and we really look forward to hearing from you.